Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Annalisa. If you're new here, welcome. Um, so today I decided that I wanted to start like an entrepreneur series since I just rebranded my business and I added a bunch of new products. So I'm super excited for that. The new name for my business is Lux Unlimited Boutique. It went from Lashaholics Beauty to Lux Unlimited. So I did that whole rebranding because I just felt like that Lashaholics Beauty was kind of too like spot on to like just makeup. So I wanted to do like clothes. I want to, well, I want to branch out to clothes. I want to do um, accessories, which is what I added. I just wanted to make it a bigger brand than what it was coming out to be at the beginning. So I have like a little notebook with like questions and stuff that, well, things I thought of that I should add in this video and I knew I was gonna forget if I didn't write it down. So we're just gonna, if you see me reading off of this, just, you know, pay no mind to that. But um, also if you hear people talking, it's my sister and she's rude. So yeah. Um, so the first question I have pretty much is like, why did I change the name? And I kind of said it in like the intro a little bit, but I just felt that Lashaholics Beauty was very um, specific to just like cosmetics and stuff like that. And I just wanted to branch out and do things more than just cosmetics, like just branch out to other stuff and like clothes and fashion. Cause I, I'm super into fashion, like I, I don't know, it's just something that I've always liked. I've always like, you know, I've always liked glam on a budget. So I felt like, hmm, I know what that feels like to be shopping somewhere. I'm like, yo, like I really don't want to pay $80 for this purse right now. Or like more than $80 obviously from bigger brands. So I was like, let me see what I can do, see what I can find. And I found obviously like other vendors and stuff like that that had like glam purses and like other things but i can sell them for a cheaper price and more affordable but still make money from it so that's that um how did i start my business so i've always wanted to start a business i've always wanted to do something like in the business world obviously like have my own brand or like own like a dance studio which i still very much want to do or like just something around there but how did I do it? It was a long, it was a long process. Honestly, like I, you can't do it overnight. So that's one thing. Like I always kept it on the down low. Like nobody knew until I pretty much had everything planned and set. And like, I was like, this is what I'm doing. This is the name. This is that. I have the products. Like I tested out everything. Like everything is good. Like we're chilling. And that's how I that's how we did it. But I'm thinking of doing like a whole series about like an entrepreneur life and stuff like that. So if you have other questions, we can talk about them in other videos. So just leave them down below. But um, another thing I have to talk about is like your like support system and like your supporters. So obviously like you're super excited about this and like you want people to like hype you up and like you know share your brand and share your business like with other people so that way you get a higher like following count like you have more followers like more people supporting you and like whatever and buying from you but sis sometimes your closest friends don't support your businesses sometimes they're haters but it's fine because you're gonna do what you want to do and that's the tea and you're gonna continue to do what you wanna do because that's also the tea. So we're gonna continue and you don't pay mind to the haters because honestly, you're doing better than them. They don't have a business, so they can't be mad. So another thing I wanna say is money. Money is basically obviously like the big part of this cause like you can't, but you can start a business with literally like $100. Like you can literally do whatever you want and it'd be possible with a hundred dollars. When I first started, I didn't have a lot of money to like put into this, but I knew it was something that I wanted to do. So I took some money, I put it aside and I was like, all right, I have this much money to spend for like my product, this much for packaging, this much for um, 
like the branding this much for ads like insta ads this much for like facebook ads like i literally sat down and i broke it down and i was like okay and then if i want to make a profit obviously i have to sell it for a certain amount of money so basically it just took it like ended up being that every time i would get paid i would take like half my paycheck literally half of my paycheck or like whatever it was and put it to my business and it was like all right like when i'll get it back one day like that's pretty much what i was thinking but yeah and then also um another thing is like figuring out what you want to sell like how when i started i just was selling lashes and then i branched out once like quarantine started hitting i branched out and i started doing lip glosses and then i started doing lip scrubs and I realized, I was like, okay, yeah, like, this is cool, this is fun, but, like, I don't want to sit here and make lip glosses and lip scrubs every day. I mean, like, I do love to do it, but, like, I wanted to do more. Like, it just wasn't enough. It was not cutting it for me. I want I wanted too much. So, I took a break for a little bit, and I was like, you know what? I'm going to figure out, like, what I want to do, like, where I'm going to get my products from, like, how I'm doing this. And then I took it from there. And now we have Lex Unlimited Boutique and we're chilling. So I'm gonna show you all of my products that I launched in my like new rebrand. And I'm gonna show you a little reel that I made, a video reel of my products and like this little photo shoot that I had, it was just me and my sister cause I didn't have anybody yet to like, you know, model these for me cause I was doing it so last minute. Like I waited literally till the last possible day to take these pictures so i'm gonna show you all of my products and everything that i got okay so i have everything here and we're just gonna jump right in um to start i got pop sockets these little rhinestone pop sockets brought this lighting yeah okay there we go these rhinestone pop sockets are so freaking cute like i got three different styles of them and they're literally like the cutest little things. So that's one of them. This is like the sunflower design. Then um, there's like one that's like a daisy. And this one's really cute too. I like the other one better though. Like that's more my style because I like the bigger rhinestones on the outside, but this one's super cute. And then we got a pearl one that's gold, just in case, you know, if somebody doesn't like rhinestones, even though I don't think that's possible. But in case somebody doesn't like rhinestones or they just want a pearl one, they can ha get this one and it's just a gold rim. And But this one's black, the bottom, the base is black. So that's cute also. And my pop sockets are $10. They're super cute. They stick to any phone, obviously. Um, so yeah, that's the pop sockets. Then we're gonna get into sunglasses. So these are the Don't Bother shades. These are so cute. Like they're just aviators, but they're much bigger than aviators. Like the lenses are a lot larger. And they have, um, you can't really tell, but they're like, polarized lenses so in the sun this is like a yellowish color around there so we have that one and these these come in like five different colors six different colors i can't remember but we have colors for everybody you see these are brown these are brown ones and we have some pink ones. These are so cute. Like, okay, yeah, these are so cute. These are like one of my favorite pairs of sunglasses. Honestly, wait, I actually am lying. I'm lying, I'm completely lying. I literally love all of the sunglasses so much, but these, my go-tos. Hands down, my go-tos, my favorite. But, okay. So then we have the same ones, aviators, with like a blue and yellow. And then I have a bunch of other ones that I just didn't feel like taking out. Because you get the gist. 
So then the next ones are our City Girl sunglasses. And these are more of like, a, just like a clear for, just for looks and like pictures and stuff like that. But these are like clear lenses. So these are the pink ones. Then you see we got like a dark blue. We have a light blue. We have a brown. Oh, the brown ones of those. Super cute. These are the blue. And then we have the brown. And the brown ones. Brown. Why am I saying that like that? Brown. The brown ones. Like, these just say to me, like, don't talk to me. I said before, these. These are my personal ones. But these are the Hollywood shades. They're super freaking cute. We have those in white. We have them in, like, a leopard print. And then in black. Oh, the black ones, hello. These are our Who Me shades. And they're so cute. They're the little round lenses. Well, they're like more oval, but these are the Who Me shades. You know, super cute. We have these in black and in an olive green and then the brown. And then I got these keychains and they're like supposed to be off-white, like the industrial keychains. Um, they're duplicates, obviously, like I'm not paying like $500 for a keychain to resell it, negative. So these are dupes. And then I have these in like six different colors. So like pink, hot pink, yellow, white, you know, orange, blue. So I have those. And then we have our purses. So the first bag I'm gonna show is this one. This is our dulce bag. So cute, it's clear. I'm like super into like the clear purses and it has a chain, like a gold chain to go around your shoulder. So you could use it like that also. <laughs> but yeah, these are super cute. I have these in three different colors. I have the mustard, then we have the cream one. This cream one, it almost looks white in the camera. And then we have a uh, lavender. And then you'll get them with like the little dust bags, but like, you know, super cute. And then we got our, I think, it's, I, think I named it See Right Through Me, See Right Through It, something like that. <laughs> But these bags, these remind me of like such like beach bags, like beachy bags. And like what I like is that you can also just take out this part, like the inside, and it's just a clear purse. We have it in two colors. We have the cream one, and then we have a black one. And it's the same thing, just different inside. So that's also like very, very cute. And then my favorite, my most favorite of them all is the Mila Graffiti bag. And this thing is literally the cutest thing I have ever seen in my entire life. Like, hello? <laughs> like she's so cute. And um, so this bag has, it has a handle, a strap, strap, here we go has a strap to put on as well on the sides. It like has like gold little straps here. Can you freaking, okay. It has a little gold like handle thingy and you can put the straps on there. And then we have that one in a, like a tan color and it's super cute. Like, so pretty, so pretty. And those are the bags. And honestly, those are that's everything that I just came out with. Then all the other stuff that's on my website at luxunlimitedboutique.com is um, older, like the lip scrubs that I have on there and the lip glosses. And if you just follow us on Instagram at, at luxunlimitedboutique and on TikTok at luxunlimitedboutique, that's a tongue twister. Um, if you follow us on there, then you get to see like all behind the scenes and like all that type of stuff. Mostly on my TikTok because then I like do packing orders and like all that type of stuff. So if you want, you can watch on there. 
and follow us and you know comment for the algorithm you know you know how it goes you know how it goes um <laughs> share my page tell your peeps let them know what's good to shop from us but um yeah that's kind of all i have for this video today but comment down below if you want to see anything else like business related or you have like specific questions and i'll do them like in a video obviously and then um i have other video ideas in here that i'm gonna do based on like a business series so we're gonna you know jump right in that and i have some makeup videos already you know in there in the mix so well we're just gonna keep pushing these out because it's our job this is our job thank you so much for watching thank you so much for supporting me and i'll see you in the next one